Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. An estimate is a preliminary sales proposal that is often created for a customer's job. You can create multiple estimates for each customer or each job. If the customer accepts an estimate, you can create an invoice from the estimate changing it as needed. QuickBooks allows you to create invoices from estimates either by transferring the entire estimate amount to an invoice or by billing only a portion or percentage of the estimate amount over several invoices. The ability to bill for only a percentage of the estimate or for various amounts of selected items within an estimate is called progress invoicing or partial billing. If you have a job for which you want to create an estimate, you can select Customers, then choose the Create Estimates command from the menu bar to open the Estimates window. Creating an estimate is much like creating an invoice, except the amounts entered into an estimate do not affect any posting accounts within the chart of accounts. Within the Estimates window, select the name of the job for which you are creating the estimate from the Customer Job drop-down menu. Note that you can create estimates for customers without jobs, but that is less common. If needed, select the desired estimate template to use from the template drop-down. Enter the date the estimate is created into the date field. Ensure the correct estimate number is displayed within the estimate number field and double check the customer and job information that is shown. After that, click into the item column within the line item area and select the first item within the estimate. Enter any associated quantity, rate, and amount information for the line item. Continue entering line items until you have entered all of the items needed for the estimate. You can print the estimate to send it to the customer if needed. You can then either click the Save and Close or Save and New buttons to finish. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.